Hi guys, it's George from Cyprus Insight. Today I'm in Ayanapa at the Tokos Paradise Village. Here we are, Rachel. Let's go and have a look around. There's reception area, and there is a massive village, guys. We've been here a couple of times, so we've seen some lovely pools around here. Let's go through reception. Right, guys. So let's go around the village here. Where there's the kids' area. There's some. Oh, games they can play then there's a little pool table now this place has got quite a few swimming pools go down here shall we oh i do like a slope look that's nice now we've got lots of two-story buildings all the way round there's the main swimming pool it's got a lovely hand rail and I do believe a slope going in or do like a slope going into a swimming pool oh look at those lovely conifers oh there's even a bridge going over the swimming pool oh what's over there oh gardens more gardens oh one moment guys there's a hand rail and a slope going into the next swimming pool look at that and that's a kids pool there under cover that's handy we've got a nice lot of shade there we are now big balconies at the top massive balconies aren't they and these verandas on the ground floor now lots of umbrellas and some best to choose from Now, shall we go into the gardens? Let's go into the gardens, go round, and then we can come back around the other side of the pool where there's a pool bar. Yeah, that's a good idea, isn't it? Let's do a right. There we are. Why well, isn't it lovely and quiet as you step into the garden area? I think we should go a little bit further down and then we can go around. Hey guys, look at this. Oh, is that Birds of Paradise? Yes, I always get confused. Looks like banana trees, don't they? But they're not. Oh. Right, let's go around the roundabout, shall we? Human roundabout it is. Here we are. Oh, it's the wrong way, isn't it? Well, humans can go this way, you see. It's been pointed out and going around the wrong way, but uh, humans can go around this way. It's human roundabout, hey? Right, let's go down here then. And now I will be going in that direction. What's behind here, though? Something else. I think it's a volleyball court. Yeah, here we are. A nice soft sand volleyball court. Ideal for the evening. Come down here and have a game of volleyball with your friends. Oh, it looks like the car park and road goes all the way round the complex. That's handy. So lots of parking as you come in. And then you can go round the complex in the car and drop off your stuff nearer to your little apartment or big apartment see the road goes round there there's a tennis court on the right around here oh, it looks like they've been doing some gardening excellent um, not sure which way to go now guys I think I'm gonna go in that direction that's just apartments, or should we go down there? Let's go down there, because we've been down the other area. Oh, I'm getting confused. Mmm, that smells nice. Ladies cleaning out an apartment. Mmm, like a floor cleaner. 
Oh, just spotted a kitchenette inside one of the apartments. Oh, let's go to the end, turn left. That's the gardens we've just been down. Ah, yes, well spotted. Each block's got its own name. That's avocado block. This one's apple block. And that's a good idea, isn't it, guys? Other than numbers and letters. That one's mandarin block. Now I think they should paint the walls like mandarin colour and orange and uh, apple and stuff. Well at least one wall anyway. Oh look, I've got the four poster double sun beds. Here we are. There's another one here. There's the bridge. I'm not going to go over the bridge this time. Oh, you can go over and over. Oh, I am. See, I thought I'll have to come back this way, but I can go over the bridge round here. Now look at this pool. So, round pool that it goes wibbly wobbly round here. You see, it's a bit hickety pickety. And we go. And I'm going to go over the second bridge. Oh, we could do a whole circuit, couldn't you guys? Here we are. Up we go. Oh, over. There's the pool bar. Let's go down. Whee. Brilliant, over two bridges. Absolutely marvellous. Right, let's carry on round here. So if you like a bit of music, guys, you can sit on this side of the pool. And you can listen to some music. Or you can sit further over the other side and it's much quieter whatever you prefer ah now there's the terrace and there's the entertainment stage look at that big stage and i guess you'll be sitting on the terrace area watching the shows just here and i guess this is where the restaurant is oh there's a souvenir shop Let's go and have a look at the entertainment. There's a big board. Now this is what's going on during the day, guys. This is the activity board. Aqua aerobics and darts and water polo. Bingo and karaoke at night. Look, mini discos are going on. Then there's a visiting jukebox Joe on Wednesday so we've got live entertainment going on on Wednesday oh, a lot's going on there for during the day there's the gift shop and I think the gift shop guys goes all the way around at this corner so it's quite a big, big gift shop so you can pick up your suntan lotion and bits and pieces for your pool if you want to play around in the swimming pool there's the main bar for the terrace. There's a list of cocktails here between three euros fifty and five euros fifty, and the wines are around three euros fifty. Oh, and the soft drinks are two euros fifty. So that's the price of your drinks, guys. If you want a slow beer, you can catch the price of a slow beer. No, doesn't matter, guys. Now breakfast is finished guys and you'll be having your breakfast out there on the terrace but this is the massive buffet area. Look, it's enormous isn't it guys? Massive buffet area and I do believe the salad bars round the corner. Yeah, there's a salad bar there you see. And it goes on and on round the corner. There we are. Wow. Go oh, back round this way, shall we? Yes, that's a good idea. Oh, can't go that way. Look, it's fenced off. <laughs> There's the gate. Hmm, look out for the gate, eh? Now, if you want to hire a push bike, guys, there's a few push bikes out here. Just ask reception. Let's go through reception area. Oh. 
just caught the door there. Oh, it's lovely and cool in here. So a lovely little reception area. There's an information area there where they're showing you videos and also they've got maps. And guys, if you have to check out and your flight's not too late in the afternoon, you can use one of these lockers for two euros, put all your luggage in. That's a good idea, isn't it? Fantastic. Hotel is set back, guys, so it's nice and quiet. We are on the edge of a Napa, but there is bus stops just outside at one euro fifty a ride or five euros for the day. So there we are, lovely, quiet location in a Napa. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if there's somewhere you'd like me to go, put it in the comments below.